Hello everyone, Travis Freeman here with this month's Ask the CFP segment. This month's question is, what happens to FSAs and HSAs at death? Now if you're not familiar with these acronyms, they're flexible spending accounts and health savings accounts. These are special accounts typically available through employers, but HSAs can be used without an employer's involvement. Flexible spending accounts are created by a special arrangement between an employee and the employer. The employee can defer a portion of her income into the FSA to be used for qualified expenses. Since the FSA is created by a special arrangement through the employer, if the employee passes away, the arrangement rules will dictate what happens with that money. For example, if the rules state that funds in an FSA at death may be passed to an employee's estate, the funds in the FSA may be payable to beneficiaries. However, the arrangement may also state that the funds are kept by the employer to pay for FSA program expenses. Now if you think that sounds harsh, typically any funds put into the account above $500 are kept by the employer at year end if they're not used for the employee's expenses. Now I won't go into all the details of the FSA in this video, but it's a use it or lose it type of benefit above the $500 level annually. Therefore, if the arrangement rules state that those funds are kept by the employer, it's not that strange. As for the health savings account or HSA, the rules are different. You can put a beneficiary on an HSA just like you would put a beneficiary on a 401k or an IRA. There aren't also any use it or lose it rules with the HSAs. So it's possible an employee could establish a decent chunk of change in an HSA over time. Regardless of whether you have $100 in the HSA or $100,000, be sure you have a beneficiary listed on the account. If you don't, your heirs may have to deal with probate court if you were to pass away. If you have a question you'd like to submit for next month's video, send it to tfreeman at rfgadvisory.com. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next month.